Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. This is Shubhanki. Hope you are doing great. So today's video is about my night skincare routine. Since most of my videos are hardcore skincare related, so I often get requests from you guys about why don't you share your skincare routine like night skincare or morning skincare. But I, for the longest time, haven't. really try to share my skincare routine just only because i do change up my skincare products so very often and i also try testing out products here and there so i do not have any fixed skincare routines but however i do have some constant products that i definitely use on a regular basis and also when i am not trying out any particular product i fall back to this particular routine so i thought why don't i share this routine with you guys hope this help you guys in any way so without me much talking let's get started with the video also if you come across my channel for the first time please click on the red subscribe button and the bell right next to it so that you guys get notified whenever i come up with a new video also don't forget to follow me on instagram i create a lot of makeup looks there and also this look is by the way is right there so just follow me there and let's start Hey guys, welcome to my voiceover. So first of all, I start by taking off my lenses. What I'm doing exactly right now? Then I start with removing my makeup by first applying a cleansing oil. I use the Good Vibes Olive Cleansing Oil. By the way, if you guys can't get your hands on to the same exact products that I'm using in this video, you don't have to worry. Always, always, always focus on the type of products or techniques. that i am using in any video rather than the brand so moving on i am gently rubbing this cleansing oil in circular motion all over my face and as you can see everything is coming out so beautifully this is i feel much better than cotton pads or makeup remover wipes and it's not good for your skin it will make wrinkles as well as not environment friendly so yeah Now I'm going to wash my face with clean water. So I'm back and now the second step is very 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 important. You shouldn't stop cleansing your face at this step cause you still have some sort of makeup residues deep inside your pores that you obviously cannot see. So to completely completely remove your makeup, I use a foaming face wash next. As you can see my face looks so clean and fresh right now. Now thirdly I'm going to use a toner this is the most basic toner that i have it's the rose water from patanjali i like how basic and simple it is i feel sometimes it's good to use very basic product otherwise i end up using so many active ingredients and my skin needs some breather so i just fall back to this simple toner you can also use the biotex cucumber toner that's also the one toner i really love now basically i'm just fanning my face so that it dries up a little bit more I tell you why I'm doing this it's very important for my fourth product I cannot apply my next product if my skin is damp or wet in any sort it has to be super super dry so the fourth product is retinol and you guys know I have hyped retinol as an ingredient in so many of my videos i would always say to invest in a good retinol product the one i'm using is from derm dog i wouldn't say it's my holy grail but yeah it's kind of fine i don't mind it it's pretty much does its job and my skin feels fine so this can be your budget friendly retinol however you can also invest in good retinol serums as it lasts really really long you just need to apply in pea size amount and also the way it battles with your acne wrinkles etc etc is really commendable so i'm just dotting it all over my face and then using my finger to spread it all over my face in dab dab motion i repeat in dab dab motion please don't rub it now the fifth product is my all time favorite product this is the rose hip serum from good vibes i use it as my moisturizer basically so i apply it a little more on my face i have pretty much talked about this product in my last two to three videos so you can guess how crazy i am about this product you can see how my skin shines as i apply it also it is so moisturizing to my skin it adds right kind of glow and as well it is very very non sticky so this is a great product 
Now the sixth one is a must for any dry skin girl out there watching this video right now. Please guys do not skip on any sleeping mask at night if you want your skin to look glowy, fresh and healthy when you wake up. The days when I feel very very lazy, I skip everything and go straight to this product after cleansing my face. I cannot do without this mask. This sleeping mask from Wow Skin Care contains aloe vera and hyaluronic acid. So it gives right amount of hydration to my very very dry flaky skin. You can see how happy I look after applying this mask. Now the very last step, the seventh step is the step which I have started doing very very recently. I just finish off my night skincare routine by pampering my eyelashes, brows and lips. So what I do is basically I use a hair growing oil which is everyone knows castor oil. Castor oil is very very popular when it comes to hair growth. So I apply it in my eyelashes and brows to get long eyelashes and fuller brow and whatever is left in my hand I then apply it on my lips in dab dab motion. So that's it for the video. Hope you guys have enjoyed the video and I will also link the products down in the description box. If you want to uh, check out the products please check the description box for the link. So yeah, I hope this video is helpful in some way to you guys. So if you like this video, please like, share, comment, subscribe, bell button. You guys know the drill. And I'll meet you guys in my next video. Until then, be happy and bye.